going on guys uh, we have this question right here it's asking the the question is find y prime so find y prime and in this case we have two variables dividing each other so in this case we have to use quotient rule when, whenever we see something dividing we use the quotient rule first so in this case first of all let's find the derivative so y prime is going to be equal to um, so the general rule is general quotient rule is the first derivative the bottom the top is going to be the first derivative multiplied by the bottom minus uh, minus bottom derivative multiplied by the top over bottom square that's the general form of question so I, I write it you will understand so my 1 minus e to the power of 2x prime top derivative then bottom uh, bottom remains the same x plus log 2x then minus now bottom derivative so I keep the top as it is so it's going to be 1 minus e power 2x then the bottom derivative x plus log 2x derivative over x plus log 2x square so in this case uh, since we have this thing so we we have to remember there's a general rule for this derivative that is whenever we have log a power x so let's say a is a number or whatever so it's going to be equal to the derivative of this one is going to be equal to 1 over x ln a so this is the general formula we have to remember before we approach this kind of question so let's do this one so first of all if you see uh, derivative of 1 is going to be 0 and here we have minus e to e to the power of 2x so e to the power of 2x and in this case we have to use chain rules so chain rule of chain rule is going to be so we uh, derivative of e to the power two x is itself because this is also a general rule we, we have to remember that e to the power of x derivative is going to be e to the power of x so that's that's another thing and uh, we have to use the chain rule right here so it's going to be two x prime two x prime and x plus log two x is going to be remaining the same because it's not a derivative so it's going to be remaining the same x plus log two x minus 1 minus e to the power of 2x also going to be remaining the same it's not a derivative so it's going to be 1 minus e to the power of 2x and here we have a derivative the derivative of x is going to be 1 because uh, 1 go to the front x 1 minus 1 is going to be x to the power of 0 anything to the power of 0 is 1 so it's going to be 1 and we have log 2x right here so we have to find the derivative so now we have to use this format so we know that uh, whatever the value on top one going to the front and land 2 right so it's going to be 1 over x land 2 so this is the derivative of log 2x and the bottom is going to be remaining the same because it's not a derivative x plus log 2x square then we have a derivative of 2x is going to be just 2 because this is power 1 so when power 1 multiplied by 2 is going to be 2 and x 1 minus 1 is 0 so anything to the power of 0 is 1 so the, in this case I can bring the 2 here is going to be minus 2 e to the power of 2x and x plus log 2x minus 1 minus e to the power of 2x then we have 1 plus 1 over x ln 2 over x plus log 2x square so this is my final answer we don't have anything else to simplify and that is that is it I hope you guys understood understood this concept see you next time